the Scorpion is your Sun, Moon, Horizon sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, in this month of May, it is the month of an Earth energy, and with the energy vibration from an Earth energy, uh, we have the energy of the Empress. Um, this month has five weeks. Um, the two first weeks is an Earth energy, and the two last week is the energy from the hair sign. Okay. Um, what is happening? What is transpiring? Um, for you guys. Um, for you cancers we are looking at situation that is going to be happening okay there is a lot of obstacles that you are going to be having with the energies of organization institution okay a lot of obstacles okay Pluto is coming to remove a Leo out of your life for good okay Pluto is coming so for you cancers whoever you are out there and you were born in the day Pluto is going to come to remove a Leo out of your life okay um, and this is going to be a situation that is going to be transparent in your life okay so five weeks in the month and we are going to start to look at uh, we're going to start to look at the first week the first week is an earth sign the second week is um a stable strong foundation the third week is the lovers fourth week you have the energy of uh, um the passion you trying to stand up for yourself and then the last week you have the energy of the two of one so a new door of opportunity is going to be coming in okay let's look at the first week the first week you have a situation with an organization and there's a lot of obstacles for you in this organization um it could be where you're working but it could be um that in um the months before there was obstacles okay and you're coming in because there was a lot of lies and betrayal and um, dishonesty that was going on in this organization a lot of people were not not being honest about certain things and certain things that transpired so there was a lot of lies and uh, situation that has come in now um, what has happened is that there is um, a particip a participation of uh, as as if the universe kind of, um have stepped in to 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 um actually um r release these lies um that was going on and these lies were occurring during the prince of swords so whoever this prince of swords is was disgusting person because he's a liar okay so the prince of sword is 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 um someone between the age of 25 and 45 that is a Gemini a Libra or a Aquarian okay so whoever this person um, is or was um, it's a very um, disgusting person that is dishonest um, the energy of uh, there's two energies the most negative cards of um, the deck from the Lemur and they have the energy of the rat and you can see it in the um, um reverse form and the energy of the snake so the energy of the snake is a woman that try to do something but she was lying there was a lot of lies that was told and that sort of a thing okay so whatever the situation with this organization now there is help it's as if they have found out the truth of the situation and they have found out that the lies that has been told and uh, now um, and, and, and they are trying to resolve the situation um, the second week there is going to be um, positive news good news is going to be coming in um, this is going to be um, help coming in for a lot of you there is going to be a new start a new opportunity so maybe there is a new offer of work that is coming in or a new offer of uh, I am sorry you know we have um, unjustly look at the situation and that sort of sort of a situation and this is going to bring positive energies back in your life okay as we move forward and we're, we're looking at um, the situation of uh, 
um, the to the second week going in the third week and what is happening is that this month for you cancers are going to be somewhat of positive energies positive situations happening because whatever that has transpired the lies that was told from an organization now you're coming out very being very successful because here you're seeing the energy where it's as if they found out that lies were told and the elephant whatever whoever in that organization because there was a lot of um barriers and that sort of a thing now it's it's ending so um the energy of the ten of one is saying that whatever lies and whatever situation and deceive deception that has occur it is now coming to an end so as we look at the third week we have the energy of the lovers now the energy of the lovers comes up for the people who are in relationship with the gemini's okay so if you're a cancer in a relationship with a Gemini's, okay, this situation, um, your your intuition could be um, warning you about a situation that is uh, about to happen, which this could be um, that your intuition is letting you know that the energy of Uranus is going to come and remove this Gemini out of your life. For some people, it could be removing them, or for some people, you're going to be going back to reconnect with this Gemini. Some of you could be having as if uh, your intuition and your guiding angels are saying, go back, release the situation out of your life, okay? As we look at the poof, fourth week, we have a situation here that is going on, and you need to protect yourself from a deception. Okay, there is a huge deception that is playing, and you need to um, release yourself from this deception. Whatever the situation is, and whatever the deception, you're protecting yourself from this deception, and this is going to be um, um, good. Because you're participating, you're not standing up and let people walk over you, or you you realize that there is a deception that is going on, and you're going to make this ill. Okay, and this is good. As we look at the last week, the energy of the two of ones, there is going to be an offer that is coming in. So this is going to be good. Um, this is going to be positive, it's going to be an offer. In um, work but it's going to also be a business offer that is coming in take this business offer there is the energy of the lover of a new someone new that is going to be coming in also okay and especially for you ladies there is a new um, someone new who is going to be um, entering your life okay and whoever this person is your spirit guides have sent them to you to cross your port your part and this is going to be good but remember there's a lot of deception some of you ladies have to be dealing with a deception and the energy of the seven of the with the energy of the snake it is lies and deceptions and um, and, and and that sort of a thing that is happening okay participants is here and new possibilities so the, the 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 situation is for the sun sign people Pluto is going to be removing a Leo out of your life okay so you could be getting divorced if you this person was not an honest person this could be someone who you have been married having a relationship with whoever this Leo is Pluto is going to be removing this Leo out of your life and this is for good so whoever you are and you were born in the day um, and you're going to be realizing and, and in the day is from 12 a.m. until 6 p.m. Um, but during that time you're going to be re realizing that if you're in a relationship with a Leo or a fire sign person but it's a Leo it is here with the energy of the Leo that they're going to be removed out of your life for good okay so you're going to be participating in this because you want this to happen and it's going to be happening as we um, look at the um, moon sign people the people that was born after 6 p.m. Um, 
and 12 a.m. in the morning um, you or especially you ladies there is a new start in a new relationship for you there is going to be a positive new start in a new relationship for you and this could be with a new friend is coming in and this woman could be a Pisces a cancer uh, a Pisces person coming in or it could also be someone who is very intuitive and it's as if the planetary system have orchestrated that this person come in your life um, to bring balance it, this person is going to open a lot of po new possibilities for you and this is going to be positive because um, there is a message that is going to be coming in about a new job offer or a new offer in business and this is going to be helping you a lot of new networks are going to be marked and new business opportunities or and possibility of new growth in your career is basically going to be coming in especially for you ladies so ladies over 40 it's going to be a very 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 positive positive um time for you guys so um be aware and um be sure um that um you stay open to the possibilities that are coming in i want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back and um namaste until next month